Today I'll be discussing Orsted's principle and the discovery of electromagnetism. What is electromagnetism? Electromagnetism is the science of charge and of the forces and fields associated with it. Electricity and magnetism are two parts of it. To begin this lesson, we have to know, who was Orsted? Hans Christian Orsted was a Dutch scientist who lived in the 19th century. He was fascinated by the concepts of electricity and magnetism. In 1820, he accidentally conducted an experiment that showed the relationship between electricity and magnetism. Soon after, he became credited with discovering the concept of electromagnetism. The experiment involved using a compass and connecting a battery to a platinum wire. Now, in this time period, ships were one of the few methods of transportation and they would use compasses as their only navigational system. Compasses are controlled by magnetic fields that surround it. But, when electrical storms occurred, the ship's entire navigational system would malfunction. When a compass is affected by lightning, it reverses the polarity, which is why they would malfunction. So, instead of pointing north, the compass would flip and point south instead. Scientists, including Orsted, didn't really understand why this happened, which became the reason he began to research electricity. In the experiment, Orsted placed the wire parallel to and directly above the compass needle. When the current of the battery was turned on, the compass needle turned. Therefore, Orsted concluded that an electric current creates a magnetic field around it. Orsted also discovered that it creates a circular magnetic field as well. He originally thought that the magnetic effect was given off by all sides of the current, but realized that a circular magnetic field is produced. His discovery led to research in electrodynamics, which eventually led to the discovery of the ampere.